Hi friends, our story this week is called Greta Thunberg and Earth. Greta Thunberg is a young lady that is helping change the way we think about the earth. The key words that we're going to be looking for in our story or our vocabulary words are protect and earth. Hmm, what do you think protect means? I think we know about Earth. Our fifth and fourth graders, we were studying Earth, and that's one of the planets, and that's where we live. If you look at a map, we're like right up here where Washington State is. Did you think about the word protect? Protect is to keep things safe or keep something safe. Just like your mom protects you. She wants to keep you safe. Just like your teacher, Mrs. MC, wants to keep you safe. So let's think about that. Hmm, do you think Greta Thunberg wants to keep the earth safe? I think that's a good question we can ask ourselves. If We can do that. Greta Thunberg and Earth. People celebrate protecting Earth on Earth Day. Earth Day is April 22nd. I want to challenge each of you to make a picture of the Earth on Earth Day, April 22nd. And let's look at a calendar. It looks like it's on Wednesday, this week, on Wednesday. Remember, we made that sign when we say Wednesday? So on Wednesday, April 22nd, I want you to make a picture of the Earth. Greta Thunberg wants to protect the Earth. There's our two vocabulary words. So as we're reading, think about what they mean. Greta was born in Sweden. Sweden, that's a different country. We live in the United States. I challenge you to look up and find where Sweden is and see how far away it is from the United States and specifically Washington State. She has autism. Greta gives speeches about climate change. Now climate change is how the weather is changing as the world has become older. I don't know if you can notice, but sometimes maybe it's colder or it's warmer. That's what she means by climate change. Climate is the usual weather in a place. What type of weather do we have in Washington State? We have sunny, we've had snow, we have sun with clouds, and sometimes we just have clouds and sometimes we have clouds and rain. Climate change could be dangerous for Earth. Why do you think it's dangerous for Earth? That's a good question. I would think dangerous for Earth, meaning it wouldn't be safe. Greta Thunberg has ideas to protect Earth. She thinks everyone can help. Protecting Earth is important to Greta. Is it important to you? Is it important to you to protect the Earth? It's great that Greta, as a young person, is interested in helping the Earth. Lots of young people want to protect the Earth because, you know, they are going to be living on the Earth. Here's the recipe. Swedish meatballs. If you have those things, you can make it. Swedish meatballs are pretty good. Show that recipe to your parents. Maybe you guys could make that together. Some more of the recipe. 
All right, here's our joke page. I have a joke. Tell me, how does the rain tie a shoe? I don't know, how? With a rainbow. Oh my goodness, that's a silly one. Look, rainbow, we know what a rainbow is. All right, here are our vocabulary words that were in the story. Let's see if we can find those words. Hmm. Was soldier in the story? No, I don't think so. Climate change, was that in the story? Yeah. So we would circle that picture of the vocabulary word. Was sleep in our story? I don't think so, so I'm not going to circle that one. Earth? Was that in the story? Yeah, we want to protect Earth. So we would circle Earth. Important? I think it's important that we save the Earth. So let's circle that one. And protect. Was protect in the story? Yes, it was. That was one of our vocabulary words. Protect. So let's circle protect. All right, it's kind of hard to see you with that background. You can see I'm using my computer. Here is our review page where we have the questions about the story. What is the paper about? Was it about coronavirus, Stress Awareness Month, or Greta Thunberg and Earth? I'll let you answer that on your own. Number two. Who gives speeches about climate change? Was it Greta Thunberg, Aretha Franklin, or Abraham Lincoln? Tell your parents who you think gives speeches about climate change. Where was Greta Thunberg born? Was she born in Sweden, Israel, or Ecuador? Hmm, that's going to require some thinking. You can look back in the video or your story that's on your computer and see if you can find where she was born. Or if you remember it, circle that one that you choose what country she's from. I'm not going to tell you. You do it. Okay. What would be great is for you to reread the story and then practice the story so you can read it all by yourself. Enjoy your week, friends.